Hi, welcome everyone back to Silent Hunter 4 Walls of the Pacific U-Boat Missions with the Imperial Japanese Submarine Mod. I also just noticed, is the game not capturing? Like, uh, audio. <laughs> One moment, I'm gonna check. Alright, I think I fixed it. Last episode, you heard my audio through my microphone. For my game as well. <clears throat> so some sound effects, like the gunshots and stuff, were there. They were just very quiet. Because you were hearing them from the ear speaker to the microphone. Well, I do apologize for that if you had a hard time hearing stuff. Uh, we only had one instance where we used the hydrophone to locate the convoy at the start of the episode, and then one mention, or one case where I mentioned the combat music flaring up because a guy with an orlick and engaged us. Alright, glad I got that checked so that this episode will also have audio. Because I notice a lot of people like the music to this mod. So, even though it's getting me content ID matches on YouTube. That being said, they haven't taken down any of, oh, or any of our video, any of the videos yet. No, it's one of ours. Where are you, Mr. Merchantman? There he is. Wait, don't be shy, Mr. Merchantman. You're one of ours. <coughs> Compared to the brutal display of... How, so how much tonnage? We got 10,000 of the tanker alone. Then we racked up about... That's about seven hundred or seven seventy one hundred tons right here. Just short of ten thousand there. So let's say about 16,000 from these, or 26,000 total. It's a little guy. Oh yes, I remember this. I remember this guy. He was always a pain to sink in uh, the American campaigns. Just because he was, he was a little guy, but he was armed. We didn't like that very much. Oh, there's a destroyer. Friendly destroyer. What are we escorting here? Hold up. What are we doing over here that requires two destroyers? What is that? It's a passenger liner, isn't it? A small passenger boat? Yes, yeah, small troop carrier. Cool. He's like, well, yeah, you want your merchantman escort. Yes, you traditionally do, but that's why I found, found it so unusual. Got like a Minikaze. We got something more modern up here? Oh yeah, we do. Fubuki. Why the twin launchers, though? It's not a Mitski either. Mitski uses triples.
And a Mooski would have single turrets as well. <clears throat> I actually don't know what that is. Is this a Matsu? No, Matsu had triple launchers. Why are these twins? I'm legitimately confused, is what the game would call that. It's got the searchlights. It's a build light, the Fubuki. That's the... That's what the game calls the Minikaze. <coughs> that's the Mitsuki there. Definitely not a Shiratsuyu, because the Shiratsuyu has the single turret forward. Interesting. So that's definitely what the game would call a Fubuki, then. Even though it's got twin twin torpedo launchers. Yeah, it's fine. Our goal is to be home by New Year's, and we're going to be there even a full day early. We'll be home the 31st. saves here. I'm going to refit first, get all our stuff back. We're going to save again. This is patrol end. Alright, let's see. One, do we get a new boat? And two, if we do, what is it? We should also get the highest marks for our medal for our, for our patrol. So we started on October 17th. We ended December 31st, 1943. So October, November, December. So about three months. A little less than two and a half months at sea. <clears throat> About 75 days. So we made our way to a grid quart, uh, quadrant, then sank 10,000 tons of enemy merchantmen. We went to another quadrant, sank another 10,000 tons of enemy merchantmen, made our way to another quadrant, sank 7,000 tons of enemy merchantmen. Inflicted heavy losses to an enemy task force. Made our way to another quadrant. Sank 10,000 tons of enemy merchant shipping. Reach, we reached Cape Down and took a picture. We then proceeded to sank what we took a picture of. And then we sank some tankers. We sank 23 merchantmen and 12... We sank 23 merchantmen and 12 warships. For a grand total of 200 and... 19,929 tons of enemy ships. We got the Knight's Cross. Yeah. So this is the first excellent patrol we've actually gotten. So these two were actually only good patrols. Knight's Cross, that's what we're looking for. So we have one, uh, one excellent patrol complete. Uh, I think this is the submarine? Very good. 
What's our new boat? Um, I'm a little confused. It's the same boat, isn't it? It's the same boat, but all my upgrades are gone. Oh, another... Stalker. Huh, never seen that ability before. the shiny new ability? Oh yeah! So I have German Auxiliary Cruiser support now. Now, again, this is why we saved. Because I'm pretty sure they gave me the, sa the same exact boat. So let me load back into the game. <clears throat> and what we're going to do is we're going to end the mission again and see if it gives me a different boat. And first let me confirm that it's a different boat. Because it wants to offer me, it wants to offer me a new boat, but it, we became I-19 compared to I-20. We got a different metal. Now we have I-30. It is actually different. It's... It's six tubes. This is one of the catapult subs. So hold up. Knight's Cross. They gave me another one of these. Look. No. Save game. the other one. Yeah, because now we got a different dude entirely. Perfect pitch. really cool. I like that ability. Now we have access to the better torps as well. You have to put the dual deck gun back on, but you can see we're made out of so much money it doesn't matter.
me load uh, this one. Let's see if it gives us a different metal. So it seems to think that that is an upgrade for us. The uh, to the Johnson B, which is one of the catapult seaplane catapult submarines. Because if I go here, we're in a C2 type. I'm curious if I, <coughs> if I sail into port right now. German cross again. And the new submarine is another Jensen B. I am still promoted. Probably gonna use this save here. That's the only one where I got the the Knight's Cross. I don't know why it's giving me a different medal this time. I'll go into the uh, the career menu after this and show you the. So it's Amelia and the Patrol. If I say no, it's still my submarine. I still get promoted, yes. Yeah. So I still got promoted. <coughs> I suppose I'll, I'll go back to the main menu now. So if I go to this... The Junson B there is at the top. This is the C2, this is what we were playing with. I don't know, did it give us a B2? It might have given us a B2. I'll reload the game and see what it gave us. Definitely was one of the float plane equipped ones. Which we can't use, by the way. That's why I avoided picking one that had a float plane. Might try one of those I-200s at the end. 
if we get access to it. If not, I can make a 1945 career to get one. I think I would enjoy that. It would be fast. We'd be very fast. We definitely want the new sub, though. The game will get hung up on offering it to us if I don't take it, which is why I'm going to take it. I-35, Jensen B. If I, uh, let's say, does it matter what room he's in for this? Any room? If I just got rid of this guy, could I even hire him? Or, yeah, too many officers. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. So, let's load the game. Yeah, okay. This is, that's the one I want. <coughs> Alright, so we got promoted. Let's uh, get acquainted with I-19. Before we do anything else, save the game. Did I have a special mark? Yes, I did. Go ahead and use a uh, a mark like that. I'll name the sub that I get. <coughs> or I'll put the name of the sub that I get in here, and we can see the detailed dates of Patrol Three. I was going to show that all happened October 17th. Except for the stuff I did that session. Yeah, we didn't end up doing too much of the first patrol. We just sank a battleship. A couple of merchantmen. We ended that patrol within a month, though. Shot down all those planes. This I made sure we were going to get the excellent rating, which is why I did all that stuff. Yeah, rank was advanced, new command was offered. <clears throat> so... This guy got promoted. This guy I don't think has enough experience to promote. Oh, well, I promoted that guy. Oh, this dude got a skill. Oh yeah, you can see our, our dudes getting stuff. I don't need to reshuffle. Gentlemen becoming skilled in torpedoes.
that guy. Command, please. <clears throat> like you watch. Who among you guys has the best leadership? Promote him to an officer because I can. Okay, I already have a command guy in there. Who among you guys has the best leadership? Maybe that guy. Can I promote that guy? I can't. He instantly gained a huge boost to command. So, what are you? Are you a damage control guy? Oh, Master Engineer. Oh, he can even repair destroyed items. Cool. Oh, he has an... He has an active ability. No, no, no. That's a passive. So, I can actually fix stuff. So Knight's Cross is the best metal out there. You know, you can have an Iron Cross. You can also have one. Get a medal. Do all of my officers have medals? You don't. All of our dudes we're going to get from here on are going to be from promotions. So we want the dual deck gun. Take a 
Bolt Type 5. Take the twin. Wherever I can get it. You can see the shell weight difference. We have our full complement of torpedoes. Since I have money to spend... Let's get our complement. Taking my electrics, I'll take acoustics. I want my acoustics loaded here. <clears throat> First, I'll, I'll, let me confirm I can actually load uh, my reserves. Gonna take any Type 89s with us now. We're gonna be taking at least Type 95s. We're gonna be taking the good torps from here on out. Okay, let me put these acoustics in here then. Five of these. Go seven acoustics. tips in here. Take ten acoustics. We f well, we fleeing these are primarily at escorts, so the lighter warhead isn't as big of a concern.
Hey, next time, we'll head out on our fourth patrol. I will see you then.